So here's some clips that Austin filmed for me while I was out of town. He did a great job of doing the before, which you guys are seeing, and also the after. Um, he had to do the move all on his own, and we used a piece of cake moving, which went all right. They did damage a few of our things. It was kind of messy. Um, it, it's just a lot, and it can be tricky when you're moving. But it was super bittersweet because I was really sad that I couldn't be there. Um, I really loved this apartment so much. Thank you, Austin, for the zoom up on your lunch. And I'm sad, and I, of course, miss it, but we are really, really happy with our new place. So let's get into the vlog. I'm back in New York at the new apartment. So naturally, this is moving vlog number three. We are going out to get a few things, and then I'm going to come back, give you guys a lowdown of everything Austin put together. But first, I have to applaud him. On the contact paper job we're currently doing right now, compared to, ah, it looks so, so great. I think he got these on Amazon. It's like a matte gray color, but he did such a good job. You did such a good job. So I'm gonna do a tour without the kitchen because right now it's under a little bit of construction. So here is our living room. This is the used table that we bought that was in our apartment. There are some minor things on it, um, but again, I bought it used for a really good price. It also has an extend option, so we can have like a full eight person um, table, which is great. Right now, I don't have a desk because we didn't have enough space to fit both a desk in um, the living room and the bedroom, so I'm gonna set up here. We'll see what we can do. I think the monitor is just gonna be out of commission for a while, but our bar cart looks great. Thank you, Austin. He did a really good job organizing it and making it pretty with all my non-alcoholic spirits. My Dyson's probably gonna move to this corner once we get some of the artwork up. And then Austin arranged the couch. Um, oh, and there's some books back here. We're gonna get a bookshelf for this wall space to hold a lot of things. We arranged the couch and we also got this rug. You guys remember the sample? She's an eight by 10, quite large. And then this is Austin's desk space. Um, if you guys recognize it, it is my old desk, but the printer's down there, papers. I think we definitely need to figure out how to organize some things. And Austin also got a new fig person. There he is. And here's our new lamp. If you guys haven't watched that vlog, I will leave it above. You should definitely check it out. And then going into the bedroom, here's our bedroom. We are working on moving the TV out to the living room to mount it, um, and then probably some better nightstands that have some storage. And Austin's also gonna put some artwork on the wall. But overall, that is our apartment update. Oh, and the rug. Austin brought a cowhide rug. It's a little bit of an eclectic touch, but that's what we got going so far. And yeah, contact paper cap and good morning. So our coffee table came and while I love the color and I love the look, I think Austin and I both decided that it's a little too big for our space. So we're getting a credenza that comes to about here. And we wanted something with a little bit more space in terms of length um, versus length this way. So something more rectangular probably would have been better to have a little more space just because our couch is ginormous <laughs> and so is our table. So. We have to figure out how to do that, but it is a beautiful colored coffee table, just a little bit of a tiny room to put it in. First round of the Target order is here. I have a nice bath mat in a gray color. We like these textured ones that don't have like the fluffy, because I feel like it doesn't um, stay wet very long and dries quickly. So got that, paper towels, toilet paper. We finally have a closet big enough to buy bigger rolls, which is crazy shower curtain and then i got this textured shower curtain from threshold i really like everything from threshold i think this is also threshold brand as well just very classic cheap so let's set this up in the bathroom all right here's the updated bathroom i've got the mat right there and then we've got our shower curtain she's a little bit wrinkly that's okay 
she'll come out in a shower and then we got a very special um shower rod it's adjustable now a weird thing about the bathroom here was that it didn't come with a shower rod which is like so strange um but the other thing we can't decide which i would love some opinions on is this yellow that we have um it's a little bit random i don't hate it but i'm confused by it you know what i mean like it doesn't really go with the gray and then like the gray wall but let me know and then here i've just got some additional storage for some of my makeup and beauty products you may remember last time this was for the pantry um, but we don't have enough organizers and then underneath Austin and I have this shared bin and then I've got these little mini bins uh, where I'm storing anything like extra makeup spares my gel nail polishes um, things like that and then in this box I also have some extra things that when I come back from LA I will have organizers for and will buy something really nice to go under here uh, but for right now this is just what we're gonna do the other thing that we did was fill out this. And the one gripe I have about this is that my old one, you guys probably remember, had a mirror in the back of this. This one does not. So I'm thinking about putting just like a stick on mirror right here so that if it's open, I can still like wash my face or like look because it's really annoying to have to constantly take all the stuff out, put it here, put it all back, close it, wash my face, open it again, put After it back. After many days and hours, we have a finished product. I showed you guys this the other day, and now we officially have this. Holy moly. It looks so good. I'll put in a little clip of the before, just so you guys can see if I haven't talked about it enough. Thank you, Austin F., for doing an incredible job. The winner of the year. Here's my outfit for dinner. I'm wearing a B and Ash dress. Really cute, I got it on Rent the Runway. And we just got our Target haul. I got some more dishwasher pods, and then these two towels from Hearth and Hand. Austin loves to wash dishes and put them on these towels, but ours are old and raggedy. I then got um, some tissues, and we got this suction thing for the sink, but it's not working as well as I thought it would. Oh, there we go. Austin, I just think I needed some water. But it's like the sponge itself is not staying. Yeah, it's a lot better. I got this hand soap, apricot and vanilla. And then what else did we get, Austin? Why am I forgetting the last thing that you put away? Oh, <laughs> the bathroom. <laughs> Nothing exciting. I just got another toilet bowl cleaner. I really like that one. I'll leave everything below. I'm now showing them to you guys in natural light and you can see how beautiful they are. Like, wow. They look so good. And we finally got the, um, the coffee table gone. Austin's gonna do some homework on a replacement. And today's task for me will be cleaning up this box. Um, it's a box within a box, and it's just a bunch of random stuff. And then I'm good, then we're finally done with the boxes. That is it for this week's moving vlog. I do have a few packages coming for a shoe organizer and a few other small little furniture items to build, but I will check in with you guys when we have more and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.